How's that? <laughs> Good. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to a new video. So I just thought I'd, I'd walk in the frame instead of, you know, just the hand and the face. Sorry it's been a little while. I thought, you know, Daniel's up here. My best friend Daniel's here from Sydney. Turn around. Daniel, say hello. G'day. So Daniel uh, helped me with some videos last year. We did um, servicing the skyline and the LED clusters. So if you haven't checked those videos out, please do. I'll put the links to both those videos in the description below. Um, on today's video, we are going to get a new steer tire. Um, when I went to QR in my, one of my other videos, um, it obviously de and started flapping about and I just kind of got the shit. So these tires have probably done less than 5,000 kilometers. So I've just bought another ATR Sport, which is in the back of the car. So I'm just gonna get that one swapped out. Good thing about the Skyline is that it fits a pair of 18s in the back quite snugly. They're a bit tight in there, like as you can see, I just get my hand in there. But we got those to do today. Um, so those are for the back because I like to, you know, kind of take off fast and it, it moves this car, so which is really good. So yeah, steer tire on the front, two on the back. Uh, we're going to take the car for a wash as well. That'll be later as well. Um, it's, it is filthy last. I probably haven't washed it since I've been a QR, so it's quite gross to be honest. It needs a wash, so that'll get done. I thought I would also talk about future plans like for videos. So at home, I've got an S14 cradle. So S14 cradles go straight in. The only thing you gotta change on the knuckles, on your factory knuckles, is the um, the toe arm bushes. So that's one thing it'll do, I will do. You can get these bushes from GK Tech. I think they're like $30 each or a pair. I'm not sure, I haven't done the full research on it so far. Got a new muffler for the back. So the one that, the muffler's on the back now is a single tipped 90s like Jasma. Muffler. The Jasmine mufflers are the same as the Nismo Weldinas, I'm pretty sure from what I know. Um, but I've also got now a three inch in and then twin three inch out as well. So I'm obviously gonna have those. I'd like to have them sticking out a fair way just for the looks. Um, I'm not sure if I wanna have them on the straight or on the piss, but that's something I can sort out later. Obviously once again, thank you for being here and I appreciate it. And thank you to the people who got me 400 subscribers. So really happy about that. I'm sorry there hasn't been videos recently, but I'm just happy to see that people are still subscribing and obviously enjoying my content that obviously already is out. So more content soon to come. So anyway, let's uh, go to the tie shop. See ya. So tyres are on, as you can see the sky just kind of come outside, so um, not sure where we're going to go now. I think we're going to go back to my house, have uh, have something to eat and drink, and then uh, I think, where are we going for there? Of course you can't. Well then we're going to wash my car, so uh, I'll see you guys after. Bye. Hello, mate. Hello. Hello. So we're back here uh, at the car wash. This is one place Daniel and I used to come a lot when we were younger. Uh, it's called Poppies, it's just some, you know, self-service. Uh, car wash. So instead of actually using the brushes that everybody else uses because they're full of rocks and it's shit, uh, I just bring my own little little concoction of things. So I got like a sponge, a chamois, some wheel cleaner, and a wheel brush. So pretty much what I'm going to do is just give it a wet, uh, hose it down with like a high pressure soap, and then I'll sponge it, wash it off, and chamois it, and we'll be uh, good to go. So oh, you can tap your card, mate. Four dollars for four minutes. It's a bit fucking expensive. I must have to um I must have to buy a car wash to become rich. Car washes and car parks. I asked for high pressure soap and getting fuck all. I'm high pressure water. How good does that look? Picking up the yellow fog light. Good for you. Yeah, 
Oh, yeah, that'll do. As long as it, oh, it's going to keep counting, that's right. Yeah. That's what, that's what money's for. Not the best way to wash a car, but mm. this is just what I do. Especially when I want to come and pay for it. If I do it at home, I'll do it. Bloody nice. Nice. Do it properly, but it's been a while since I've washed my car, so. Those yellow floggies look really good. It's a uh, mm. fucking shit too. Just a nice touch. Good for you. Yeah, very good for you. Put airs on your chest. It's always got to be shamoist. Oh, there's a stage yet. Go on, give it some. Go on. <laughs> that sounds rough. Ting, 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 ting. Go on. Didn't even crack gate, what a pussy. Clapped. See, real men crack gate. I'm not saying a real man, but a crack gate. Huh? Oh, nice. You gotta have fun, mate. You have to have fun in your videos, otherwise they're pointless. Right. I was gonna do something really racist there, would have thought, no, I better not. Thanks <laughs> <laughs> making friends. <laughs> Well, I can't that sound pretty good, but it'll sound better when I put the other muffler on. Single doodle? Dual doodle. Hey? Okay. Yeah, we need double doodle. Single doodle's good, but double doodle's better. <laughs> well, it's yeah, no, more or less. No, it's no David Dobrik vlog. We're not going to go out there and give someone 10,000 fucking dollars in cash, but... Uh, can we? Oh, if I had it, can I get 10,000? You could totally do that. You give me 10,000, and I'll do nothing for you. How does that sound? He doesn't like that trade. You always, it's, you always get something for something, mate. Yeah, exactly. You could tickle my pee pee and I think about it. Well, tickling pee pee's is not really the bloke thing I like to do. I'd rather tickle my own pickle. <laughs> but you know, just so you know, no one does you like you. <laughs> something you've got to remember. <laughs> He's not wrong. This is how I wash my car. I don't normally wash my car here because I'm normally a pretty tight ass, so. It's, I think it's just cost me $11 or something for a shit car wash, but anyway, I'd rather do it myself at home. Um, oh, other news, I got a new clutch by the way, so I've got some heavy duty Exidy fucking thing. And I found it's rated like 650 horsepower, but I won't be going near that because I'll break other shit before that happens. <laughs> so, I also lost one of my weather shields at QI, if, you haven't, if you've noticed, they're not actually on the car. I lost one, but then I found it again, so they're at home hiding in a cupboard where they can sit and not get lost again because I'm afraid I'm going to lose them. And whoever, whoever actually watches this channel that has a 33 four-door or just a sedan in general will know that four-door wear shields are very expensive, especially genuine ones. So, yeah, so normally, as I was saying, I normally just wash my car at home, but I normally do it properly. Obviously, bucket and sponge and shit. Instead of just spreading dirt around my car, I'd actually do it properly. So, anyway, looks somewhat decent. Oh, one thing I forgot. We got a fucking tie shine. We don't have any tie shine. No tie shine. Oh, well. The new tyres do good, so freshies on the back, and you steer on the driver's side. Bloody beautiful. The Vikings. I'll see how they last later if I do any naughty boy stuff. We'll, we'll leave it at that. Right, anyway, um, car's washed, so it looks good. There's Daniel. Bit of a faggot. No, just kidding. No, he's, he's great value, I love him. He's good. Um, so, yeah, car's washed, looking beautiful. The climb is up really nice, which is good. I always like my wheels are good, but. If it's one of these wheels, I don't know which wheel it is. One of these wheels, I kind of scraped, and I'm really not happy about it. Yeah, look at that. Spewing. I scraped and put it on the kit on the, uh, when I was putting the car in the trailer, when I was going to QR. So anyway, uh, Daniel and I are gonna go to his house. He's gonna get his glasses, because he can't fucking see, he's blind. Uh, <laughs> so. Yeah, it's funny. It's funny. 
Anyway, yeah, so we're going to his house, get his glasses. Then we're going to go for a drive into the city. I'd like to get a photo and some footage of my car near the Story Bridge because the Story Bridge looks really nice at night time. So anyway, I'll see you guys shortly. Right, so we're making some dodgy shit here. Daniel's got his phone because it's really quite dark. So if you turn around, Daniel, you'll see the Story Bridge. So there's a Story Bridge there, but if you turn around and try and look at my car without a light, you can't see fuck all. So this is, at the end of the day, he's going to, yeah, there we go, phone's back. At the end of the day, this is a good idea, but a bad idea because I can't see jack shit with a GoPro, so I'm going to have to change, um, I'm going to have to get another camera that's good for night time or work something out with this. This is a bit of a bust, but we're going to go from here. We're going to go, Daniel and I are just going to go for a bit of a walk around, but anyway, um, we'll go from here and we'll find somewhere else. So anyway, just bear with us and we'll go somewhere else. Bye. <laughs> the Story Bridge thing didn't really, you know, work, but uh, at least Daniel and I, we've had, we've had a bit of fun. We went to the Story Bridge Hotel, we had a beer, which is good, so that was probably the highlight to our night. So now we're just uh, on top of a car park in Brisbane, um, and yeah, it's really good light. So. Nothing really else to change that we've, you know, we've done to the car, so bit of a boring video, but it was content, so I'm glad you, you know, if you've stuck around this far, I really hope you have, because that obviously make, you know, makes me feel happy, so um, definitely more content to come soon. Um, I'm going to tuck the loom in the front, because that's something that needs to be done. So yeah, cradle, loom, the gearbox is going to come out as well, because I've got to take the box back to get um, repair, because i got a new clutch, but... They had problems um, sourcing a gear set because the gear set in there is pretty tired. Uh, I don't know how it happened. Um, that can that can be information for another video. So, thank you very much for watching. Thank you for getting this far. I really appreciate your support, guys. You know, if you enjoy my videos, please leave me a comment. Follow me on Instagram. Um, I'm really thinking. Don't you come this way, Cookie? I'm thinking. I'd really like to get these in like a, a small slap sticker, so I can have one say on the window here which would be really nice, do with like the little YouTube logo or whatever, so um, yeah, if you're interested in getting one of those, please let me know in the comments below, because anyway, I asked if people wanted to buy these ones, I've had no replies, so I'm still obviously wanting to get, say at least a minimum of five people to want to get one of these um, window banners before I actually put an order in, because I'm not going to waste my money, so, well Daniel says he wants one, but see, Daniel doesn't have a sedan, Daniel's got a Mercedes, but... I have a sedan, but it's... That's a sedan. A sedan garage. That's fine, it can be a Japanese Mercedes. It'd be a Jap Merc, okay. Anyway, <laughs> alright guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate the views, so I'll uh, see you in the next one. Hit the subscribe button if you're interested, and I'll see you soon. Bye. That's right. So I'd love over here just got excited about my car, and I just gained a subscriber just by standing here. How good. Can't complain. Well, watch out, love. I don't know what she's doing, but anyway. Yeah. That's what we like. Oh, it's like a perfect circle. How good. Anyway, bye.